Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Thanks so much for stopping by. If you're new to my channel, my name is Shanique. If you're not new, welcome back. If you're not new, you will know that I enjoy doing hauls. So today's video is going to be a haul. It's a spring slash summer trends haul featuring Shein.com. If you've seen any of my other videos, you may have seen me talk about Shein before. They've actually sent me some pieces for review, but um, everything in this haul actually I purchased myself, so none of these pieces were sent over to me. This video is not being sponsored in any type of way. I just wanted to show you guys the pieces that I got because I've been like addicted to shopping on Shein lately. They have so many like trendy pieces for like a fraction of the price compared to like places like Zara or anywhere else online where shirts and stuff can be like 50 bucks. These things are really affordable. Now if you're not familiar with Shein.com I will link below the video where I talk about them more in detail. The thing with Shein.com is a lot of times things can be hit or miss. Most of the things that I picked up are a hit, but I do have a few misses. Um, so if you want tips on how to shop on Shein.com, I will leave more information down below. Plus, I will link the video where I talk about it. But I would definitely say the most important thing is to read the measurements because the sizing can very widely and also to read the reviews a lot of times people will post pictures or um, write reviews on how the item was and that can be really helpful i also want to say that shein.com has an app but i wouldn't recommend shopping on the app i recommend shopping on their u.s website which i will link down below because on the u.s website you can pay a dollar 99 for return insurance that way uh, once you pay the $1.99, if you need to return or exchange anything for whatever reason, you can do that free of charge. If you don't pay for the $1.99 return insurance, it ends up being like $5.99 per item, I believe. So yeah, definitely recommend shopping on the Shein website. Plus, I will write down any coupon codes they have at the time. Um, they tend to always have coupon codes. I actually got $40 off of my purchase because it was over $200 so yes all that info will be down below and without further ado I'm just gonna go ahead and get started cuz this video is gonna be forever alright so the first thing I want to talk about is this kimono that I got it's like a maxi kimono it has like that waterfall collar um, detail and it's long sleeved as you can see it's like completely sheer and then it has a little tie so you can cinch it at the waist and like I said it's maxi so it's like it's like ankle length ankle length on me ankle length ankle length it comes down to my ankles on me I got mine in a size medium I will list the prices of everything on the screen because the prices do change so the price that I paid for might not be the price right now so I will um, put the price on the screen of how much the item is currently but yeah it just looks like this I absolutely love kimonos and I really love this one it's really good quality I'd say it's true to size and yeah I just love black and a black sheer kimono does it for me so I got another kimono and it looks like this and it has this nice embroidered detailing on the sleeves and as you can see the sleeves are mesh and then it also has it at the bottom and then it has this fringe at the bottom and the embroidery is beautiful I will say a lot of the threads are loose so I'm gonna have to cut the thread so the quality isn't the best on this one but I think I paid around $15 for it um, and it's like an easy fix you know I just have to snip off the loose threads but this is one size fits all I would say this would fit anywhere between an extra small to a large um, it's really long it comes all the way down to my ankles and again like I said I'm 5'4". The next item I picked up is this velvet slip dress. Now to be honest I'm kind of over the whole velvet thing but when I saw this I really couldn't pass it up because it's still like a timeless dress to me because it's black. It has like the eyelash lace in the front and in the back and then the straps are stretchy and it has a side zipper and it's more of a midi length on me and it has the eyelash lace at the bottom as well as a slit on both sides and I'm pretty sure I only paid like nine bucks for this and the quality is really really good I'm really really happy with this piece it's nice and solid and I actually sized down for this because the review said to size down and I would say 
I'm happy with that choice. So instead of the medium, I got a small. So I would recommend sizing down unless you're like really tall, like five, nine or taller. But yeah, I'm really happy with that piece. Okay, so this next piece I actually placed a separate order for. I ordered all of these pieces at once and then I went back and got this piece because I just couldn't resist. And it's this romper. It's white with like black trimming. And then this is what the sleeves look like. And then the black trimming is like a velvet material. And then it has like, um, you tie it at a bow at the waist and also at the neckline. And then this is what the shorts look like. And I got mine in a size medium and it looks pretty true to size. If anything, maybe a little bit more on the smaller side, so like a small medium. So keep that in mind that you might want to size up if you are taller or if you have like boobs or a booty. So the next thing I picked up is also a romper. And it's like that satiny like pajama material. And it has these ruffle sleeves at the bottom. And as you can see, the neckline is like completely open. So I definitely am going to wear something underneath, maybe like a lace bralette or a bodysuit or something underneath. But if you're, you know, if you want to be daring or risque, you can wear nothing underneath. Um, but yeah, as you can see, that's completely open. And then you tie it at the waist. And then this is what the shorts look like. They're really nice and flowy and cute and they match the sleeves. And the shorts are lined, so it's not going to be see-through, which is a definite plus. I'm living for anything in this satiny material. I love, like, pajama-inspired clothing. So, yeah, this is absolutely gorgeous. I got it in a size medium. I would definitely say it's true to size. And, yeah, this is definitely for after the baby, but I love it. The next item I want to talk about is actually a miss, and I'm so sad because I absolutely love it, but it just didn't work out for me. And it's this top, and okay, let's look at the sleeves. The sleeves are absolutely gorgeous, like these big exaggerated bell sleeves, and it's cropped, and it has eyelash fringe, and it has a high neck, and then it has a gold exposed zipper in the back. Everything about this top is perfect except for this little bandeau underneath and you will see it in the try on portion but it just doesn't cover my boobs this is actually a size large so I don't know whose boobs these are gonna cover because they don't cover mine they cover like literally half of them and yeah I just kind of wish that this part was longer or it just didn't have this part in it at all because I can't wear it because it just looks weird because the bottom part of my bra or whatever is going to be showing but yeah so sad and I think a large is the largest size that it comes in so I can't even try to get an extra large to see if the bandeau part will be longer but yeah it's a great top just executed poorly the bandeau part needs to be longer and yeah sadly that's going to be going back so I picked up some other sheer tops because obviously I'm obsessed I got this black one. Oh, it's backwards. It's got like a high neck as well. I don't know if you can see the lace detailing on the high neck part, but as you can see, it's completely sheer and it's like this floral lace detailing. It has an invisible zipper in the back and the sleeves bell out. I'm like obsessed with bell sleeves. Statement sleeves are like super in this season. So yeah, I'm super obsessed with this. I got this in a size medium. It has a little bit of stretch to it. I do think it's meant to fit like really tight to the body, kind of like a bodysuit. So I would say it's true to size. But if you want it to have a little bit more room, I would go up a size. But like I said, I got a size medium. And I can't wait to wear this with like a black bralette underneath tucked into something high-waisted. And then I also got this top, which I think is absolutely adorable. I love light pink it's probably my second favorite color next to black and it has like quarter length sleeves with these little ruffles and I hope you can see the little polka dots on it it's completely sheer as well and I got this in a size large because I wanted it to have a little room I didn't want this to be skin tight and so I'm happy that I got a size large if you want it to be tighter I would stick with your normal size but yes this is absolutely adorable I cannot wait to wear this the last sheer top I got is this one, and this is absolutely perfect. I got this in a size medium, I believe, 
and I'd say it's true to size. It's not really cropped, it's just like it stops right at my waist. But as you can see, it has this beautiful floral lace detailing and then this ruffle detailing on the sleeves. And then the sleeve have this elasticated detailing at the bottom. It has a keyhole back with little buttons and it's a high neck and I just absolutely love this top like I love it the quality is on point everything about this top is amazing I would definitely get this top in other colors like if they had a pink or even a light blue that would be amazing but I absolutely love this top next up are two pairs of pants I'm gonna start with the one that was a miss first and there's actually nothing wrong with these pants just I don't think they're worth it for what I paid for I believe these were like 16 bucks but they do look exactly how they look on the website I guess I was just expecting them to be a little more fashionable instead of like sweatpants looking I don't know they basically just look like wide leg sweatpants to me they're one size fits all and they really do stretch so I do think these would fit like an extra small to an extra large if you're kind of you know leery about ordering something that's one size definitely stretches definitely is a nice soft material but I don't know I just don't think it's really worth the $16 because they look more like sweatpants and I guess from the website I thought they would look more like you know fashion excuse me fashionable pants so I don't think I'm going to be keeping those but I also got these pants and I absolutely love these these are also one size fits all and as you can see they definitely stretch so I think these would fit you know a wide um, variety of sizes but they're just these blush pink pleated pants they're a really nice thick material so I don't think they're going to be see-through or anything like that they just have these pleats going down and I would wear these high-waisted and they stop like right above my ankle and I don't know they're just absolutely adorable I think this lace top with these pants um, tucked into these like tucked into these pants would be really cute and I believe they also had these in like a charcoal gray color but I absolutely love this blush pink color this next thing is another miss um, I'm pretty sure I'm gonna be taking this back but it's this off the shoulder um, gingham I don't know gingham checkered dress so it has elastic so it's off the shoulder and again it has these bell sleeves and it's just a shift dress so it's not tight fitting or anything but I don't know I just don't like the way it looks on me right now it may look better you know once I'm not pregnant anymore but I don't know I'm not completely feeling it you guys let me know what you think I got in a size medium and I definitely would say it's true to size but I don't know it just doesn't look right on me right now um, and I don't know it's a nice material though really there's nothing wrong with the dress it's a nice material the material is lightweight but it's not like flimsy or anything um, but yeah I'm just I'm not sure about that one next is this dress and sorry if it looks a little weird but I just washed it so it's actually a little damp um, you'll see it you know better in the try on part but it's this off the shoulder dress so it has sort of like a sweetheart neckline and it has like that sticky stuff so it'll stay on your chest and I love that it's off the shoulder and the sleeves are actually detached so you don't have to worry about you know it actually slipping off your shoulders or riding up or anything like that so this is what the sleeves look like and I just learned that these blue and white stripes are called baker stripes I believe and baker stripes are like everywhere this season um, and yeah I'm loving them but yeah it's just a nice like billowy dress <clears throat> like I said those are the sleeves and then it has a little tie detailing on both sleeves then like I said it's just off the shoulder this dress is super adorable it's super flattering on me right now that I'm pregnant and I absolutely love that dress the review said to size down and I did and I would say sizing down is a good idea this next dress is kind of similar in the sense that it also has baker stripes but I do think I'm either going to return this dress or exchange it for a larger size I'm not exactly sure but as you can see it's a shirt dress has a white collar has cut out um, shoulders and then it has like cut out sleeves with like these bows going down the sleeve and then it has like white cuffs at the end and yeah it's just a shirt dress it definitely doesn't fit me right now and I don't know I feel like it's a true size medium but 
I would like it better in a large because I would really like it to have like that oversized shirt feel. I just don't know if it's going to like look weird. I absolutely love the bow detailing, but I don't know. I'm either going to return this or size up and get a large. If you want it to fit, you know, more to your body, I would say stick to your true size. But if you're taller or want it to be more oversized, I would definitely say size up. But I'm not sure about this one either if I should keep it or just return it all together. You guys let me know what you think about this one. Again, with this next dress, I apologize if it looks strange, but it just came out the wash, so it's a little damp. But it's this black little shift dress, and it just looks like this. I got it in a size medium, I believe, um, and it's true to size. And what's cute about this and what makes it different from like just a basic shift dress is it has like this crochet paneling right here. So it's sheer, and then it also has it at the waist. I'm not sure how well you guys can see it but I absolutely love this dress I've already worn it and I just feel like it's a staple dress in my wardrobe I can just throw this on when I don't know what to wear throw it on with like a kimono over it I could wear like any color sandals with it any makeup look I just absolutely love this and I think it was like 10 bucks I'd say um, it's made really well I love the little crochet detailing and I think it also comes in pink or green but I'm glad I got black because black is just my favorite all right this next kimono is a miss so it is going to be going back and I love everything about it it's this beautiful black eyelash lace and it has like eyelash lace paneling it has a little tie with tassels if you want to you know cinch it in and it's a maxi kimono so it goes all the way down and it has eyelash lace going down but the only problem with this is and, and this was true to size I believe I got this in a medium but yes the only issue is I don't know if you can see but the lace is so thin that it has snags in it it came already snagged and I just already know like if it came already snagged that I'm definitely gonna snag it um, so yeah the issue with this is the material is so thin like the lace is so thin and delicate it just looks like it'll rip easily or get holes in it easily and yeah this would be perfect if the lace was like a thicker material it's like that stretchy like net like lace and yeah that's just not gonna work out for me it already came damaged um so yeah it's just not gonna work out but i absolutely love it i'm really sad that it didn't work out but i wouldn't recommend it just because the material feels so cheap and delicate and then the last thing is my f one of my favorite if not my favorite things um, that I got from Shein and it's this dress and it's this gingham print gingham is like so in all over the place obviously I'm obsessed um, off the shoulder again super obsessed with off the shoulder and then the sleeves are like ruffly it has this built-in like white tank top underneath and then it's just like a really flowy material I will insert a picture of how I wore it because I wore it last week and I just absolutely love this dress like yeah this is probably the my favorite thing out of all the things that I got I just love the sleeves everything about it is just so cute I just love the black and white gingham I'm like all over that and I got this in a size medium I was so afraid that it wasn't gonna fit because there were no reviews on it but I'm happy that I got a medium so I would say it's true to size and yeah I just like this is freaking adorable I'm obsessed all right you guys that does it for my haul video yeah hopefully it wasn't too long I got a lot of stuff hopefully it was helpful you know gave you guys some insight on how to order from Shein um, if you're interested in any of these pieces I will definitely leave a link down below for everything as well as list all the information down below on what size I got was it true to size everything like that please subscribe if you haven't already and if you'd like to see more videos and yeah thank you guys so much for taking time out of your day to stop by my channel watch my videos I really appreciate you guys and as always I will catch you guys in the next one bye